How's it going everybody? Gaming Grandpa here. This is episode two of Arcade Series Pac-Man and it's the last of the four of the Arcade Series games. I beat Miss Pac-Man Dig Dug in Galaga. Now, the funny thing is, I'm going to show you the achievements I got since the last episode. It's kind of funny. Uh, okay. Alright. The Nom Nom 3, Nom Nom 4, and this one where you have to eat two fruits and all four ghosts four times in a single round. I had five lives set on, and or five lives turned on in the settings, and I died three times and still got this achievement. The fruit, unlike Miss Pac-Man, if you die, the fruit still comes out based on how many dots you eat. So if you die fairly early on, I ate four ghosts and then I ended up dying. Then I ate a fruit, then I ate four more ghosts, then I died, then I ate a fruit, and then I ended up getting the achievement. So, just because you die if you've eaten two or three consecutively, don't give up. Just keep trying, and you'll end up getting it. Now, I, I also got the Picky Eater achievement. Uh, this one was actually harder than eating a four ghost four times. It really was, because you can't... It seems like when you don't want to eat the ghost, they come looking for you. It's just ridiculous. I had to reset, I don't know how many times, because a stupid ghost would come right into my path instead of running away from me. Now, I know Pac-Man is based off of patterns and everything else, but, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, the one I'm working on now is the fruit basket. You have to eat, I don't know where, what is it? You have to eat all five of these fruits. The cherry, of course, is first level, round one. Strawberries, round two. The orange is round three and four. The apples, round five and six. And the melons, round seven and eight. Now, I do have it set to 10,000 every, I'll get a free life every 10,000. And I still have one more level to go before I get to it. I just passed level five, so I have one more apple to go. And then I get the melon, which is the last one I need. So I'm hoping I can get through at least one and a quarter levels. But we'll see. Now that I'm making a video of it, my luck is probably won't, oh, for crying out loud. I really hate when this shit pops up. And excuse my language, but... I'm glad they pop, but on a side note, it's like, oh my god, it's just ridiculous because I can't see and my attention is taken away from it. Alright, we're going to go ahead and eat some ghosts now that I can. Give me a little bit of leeway. Ah! See, the fruits come out multiple times, though. Like I said, it's based off of how many... Dots you've eaten. And in case you're not in case you're wondering, I'm just trying to get past this level to get my achievement. Because after all, that's what this is about. There we go. Okay, all I have to do now is eat this stupid melon and then start the next stage, evidently. Now I died. Unbelievable. Oh well. I'll be so pissed. There it is. Come on, achievement. Come on. It should pop. I ate all five of them in one playthrough. Uh, there we go. Alright, now I'm going to try to just get past this level so I don't have to do it again. Ah! Once again, it messes you up. Alright, but that's what I was trying to do was get that one right there. The fruit basket one. Basically, if you can... What I, would, what I did was, I did the picky eater one. Go for that one, and then once you get there, then you have level four, five, six, and a little bit into seven, and you'll get the achievement. With your five guys, you should have six by that time. I didn't lose a guy until I got to level six, and then I lost, lost or level five, rather, I lost a guy. But as you see, I still have a couple guys left. So pretty much now, it's, it's home selling from here, because all I have to do now is just clear levels, and eat 
per level. And the good thing is, like, as long as you clear the level, you can level select to that level. So it's really not that hard. I have the hard ones done out of the way. So, you know, pretty soon, hopefully, I'll complete this game and do a wrap-up. So I'm probably going to have one more quick episode just to show you what's going on, you know, when I get ready to get close to getting some of the achievements. So until then, look out for the next episode, and y'all have a good night.